Welcome to Wafik. Today, we'll guide you through creating an invoice quickly and efficiently. Let's get started. First, navigate to the side menu and select Sales, Invoices, and Add New. This action will open the Create Invoice page. Now, let's fill out the invoice details. Begin with the customer's name. You have the option to select an existing customer from the drop-down menu or add a new one right here. For this demonstration, let's select an existing customer. Moving on to the invoice number, Wafik offers you the flexibility to auto-generate a number that follows the last known invoice or edit it manually to create your own numbering pattern. If this is your first invoice and you prefer Wafik to handle the numbering, just set a pattern like NVAB0001. For subsequent invoices, Wafik will increment this automatically. Next, select your invoice currency from the list provided. Set today's date as the invoice date, and don't forget to specify a due date. At this point, you can also enter additional information if necessary, such as a purchase order number, reference, the project it's associated with, or the warehouse name. Let's now turn our attention to adding your products or services. Enter a description for each item, like MacBook 23, choose a sales account. It's simplest to start with the default sales account provided by Wafik and set the quantity. Let's say two and enter the unit price. If applicable, you can add tax by selecting the appropriate rate. For that line item, you also have the option to assign it to a cost center. Just click to select one. This is particularly useful for tracking revenues by department, for example. Additionally, you can add a line item discount by selecting plus discount and specifying it in percentage form. Feel free to add more items by clicking Add Line and repeating the steps for each new item. To help streamline the process, new line items will inherit the same cost center, account, and tax rate as the previous item, making it easier to fill out your invoice. If you need to rearrange the order of line items, simply click and drag the drag handler on the left of the row. And if you find that an item needs to be removed, click the drag handler and select the Remove option. If you need to apply a discount to the net total, click on Discount on Total located at the bottom of the page. Here, you can choose the appropriate cost center and tax rate for your discount, ensuring it aligns with your financial management practices. The Notes field is there for you to add any extra details about payment terms or specific payment instructions that might be helpful for your customer. And if there are any documents that you need to attach to your invoice for record keeping, such as contract agreements, click the Attach Files button at the top of the window. Once all the details are correctly entered, you have the option to save this invoice as a draft or to finalize and send it. After finalizing, you'll be redirected to a page where you can either send the invoice directly via email or use the generated link to share it on platforms like WhatsApp. And there you have it, your first invoice issued with Wafik.